Hello biologists and welcome to this session where we're going to take a look at the treatment for diabetes. Now there are two types of ways in which you can regulate your blood glucose concentration and help to keep it within a certain range which aren't these two on here. So you have as well as these two on here you also have uh, eating less sugars within your diet. Do not say a balanced diet, you don't get any marks for that. You have to say reduced sugars. And another way is doing exercise regulates because uh, in when you exercise, you're undergoing more aerobic respiration, which uses more sugars to generate that ATP needed for muscle contraction. But in type one diabetes, you do not produce insulin because your beta cells have been attacked by your immune system in an autoimmune response. So you have to inject yourself with insulin. Now, insulin used to be taken from pigs and injected into people however this has all kinds of ethical and religious issues with it so what we do now is we genetically engineer insulin um, using this kind of procedure now you'll learn about this later on so you don't need to know in detail about how this works but all you need to know at this moment in time is that um, this is a lot more advantageous because we can produce a lot of it in a short period of time there are very few ethical issues here involved uh, and religious issues as well and um, we can produce a large quantity of the insulin in relatively safe and sterile conditions as well the other way in which um, we're exploring at the moment uh, in ways to treat diabetes is using um, stem cells. Oh. So what they can do here is they can create uh, an induced pluripotent stem cells from um, your tissue, such as your skin. Uh, so they treat it with repro reprogramming factors. So it goes back to a pluripotent stage. And then what they can do is change the culture of this to stimulate different variety of cell types. So here we have blood, gut and cardiac. But in the case of treating treating diabetes, what they could do here is cause uh, beta cells to be made from the islets of Langerhans, which could then be implanted back into the pancreas in theory. But this is still undergoing trials at the moment. And that is pretty much all we need to know here for the potential treatments for diabetes. Um, like I said, you'll learn more about genetically modifying a bacteria at a later stage. Guys, good luck with your exams and all the best. Oh.